I swear to God, if there's another red Skittle in that bowl, you're gonzo. Light ranch. Pack up your shit. Light ranch for our carrot sticks. I don't even How care. Hard is that? How hard I don't is even that? care about red How hard Skittles. Is that? How hard is that? Oh, dude, wait, run, run. Uh, hey, welcome back to another episode of Movie Feuds. This week, uh, 21 Jump Street, right? We're doing 21 yes. Jump Street. We're filming that one, or no, we're doing a review? No, right? we're doing that. Yeah, okay. The camera did not pick up the opening. We're it, cool. It, we, how hard is that, though? I mean, really, it's light ranch. Well, yeah, the snack table should always Orange be filled. We are on. We need to start looking at this more often. 21 Jump Street. Yeah! Why do you always jump across the car like that? Because it looks cool. You try. Uh, you okay? I think I shit my pants. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, I'm not a big Channing Tatum fan. Not even really a big Jonah Hill fan. I kind of liked him super bad, but uh, he's the same character every. That's true. Time, you know? uh, Channing Tatum, though, typically your romantic comedy slash kind of you know high school teen movies. Yeah, it doesn't do anything. You know, it doesn't him. do anything worth its salt, as the kids say. So I'm just gonna tell you right now. I liked it. Wow. I loved it. You want real world? Yeah, let's do it, man. Come on. Here's real What's world. What's your real world? <laughs> what was that? Do you hear that? Good enough for you. Right off the tee, once again, as the kids say, this movie's got two things going against it. One, it's a Hollywood remake, which I can't stand most of the time. Like Starsky and Hutch. Two, it's a remake of a freaking TV show I could give a shit about. Like Starsky and Hutch. Officially transferred. Where did we report? Down on Jump Street. 21 Jump Street. I was skeptical as well, but I thought that they did a pretty good job giving a nod to the old 21 Jump Street. Um, I liked how it was self-referential too, just making fun of the fact that it's a remake and it knows it. They had the boss on there from Parks and Rec who does a great rant about how they're reintroducing an old police policy of undercover cops because the police department's out of ideas. Obviously, you know, mocking Hollywood for running out, out of ideas. ideas. Yeah, running out of ideas. We're reviving a canceled undercover police program from the 80s and revamping it for modern times. One of these programs involves the use of young, immature seeming officers. I think you idiots are perfect. So you brought up Channy Tatum earlier. I think he was kind of the surprise steal of the show. I, I thought he was actually better than Jonah Hill. Jonah Hill falls into that category of comedians where he looks funny, he looks the part, so it's easy to fall in love with his role on film. Possibly why I thought he was less funny in this, because he lost 40 pounds for the role. Travis, are you gonna eat all the pretzels or put some of them on the snack table? Just let it go. Wait until after the show. You will be going undercover as high school students. You are here simply because you look young. You some Justin Bieber, Miley Cyrus looking mothers. Captain Sassy. Let's not forget about Ice Cube, who plays a stereotype version of himself. I know what you're thinking. Angry, black captain. It ain't nothing but a stupid stereotype. I'm black, and I work my ass off to be the captain. Every scene he was in, I was ROFL, as the kids say. They actually do say that, which is first time through, through sexting. Let's take a step back and talk about the story a little bit. Uh, Channing Tatum and Jonah Hill's undercover cops go inside the school to investigate a drug ring. Which leads to great comedic hijinks. My favorite part, they're in the bathroom stalls making each other throw up, After trying to find the each other. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you gotta pull the trigger. Look at this, you gotta pull the trigger. Oh. You gotta throw up, man. I can't throw up, man. They keep Billy him died. You gotta throw up. Just think of something gross. Let's just finger each other's mouths. No. Yeah. No, you're not we got fingering to... my mouth. Do you wanna die? Do you wanna die? Okay, fine. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> There's an opening couple of scenes when we look at Jonah Hill and Channing Tatum as police officers the when bike cops. Channing Tatum doesn't know the Miranda rights, but then they make their first arrest. Oh, yes! 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 10 years. Wow, really, 10 years. Well, when did Zoolander come out? Like, earlier than that, but one, Bridesmaids, so. The Hangover, super bad. Hangover, Those overrated, super bad, funny to start. Bridesmaids, a good chick flick. 
Well, tune in next week as we do Bridesmaids, because clearly that's our next... That's happening, huh? That's happening. He's really like that. All right. Well, there you go. Well, I thought, you know, the movie critics, uh, the real ones anyway, had this kind of right on the spot, you know, right on the 70, 75%. Mm -mm. I'm going to go mm -mm. ahead and give this uh, eight Peter Pan hats out of 10, though. Okay. Well, I think that that's a little low for what it deserves, which is 15 ice cubes out of 17. Which is actually pretty consistent with what I said, but, you okay. know... I thought this job would have more car chases and explosions and shit. More than just reviews, this is Movie Feuds. Okay, I already see red Skittles, so don't even bother going to the tray. Don't even bother putting it on the tray on the table. Put, turn around. Okay. You're fired. You're fired. I'm not gonna lie. Not a huge Channing Tatum fan. Uh, not Channing really big. Channing Tatum? What was his name? Channing Tatum. Tatum. Okay. That sounded weird. I didn't name him. Right off the tee, as the kids say. I don't okay. know what that means. Like on the golf course, like off a tee? <laughs> just like right off of tea time, like in England? <laughs> Travis, are you going to eat all the pretzels or put some of them on the snack table? Just let it go. Wait until after the show. He needs to let it go. Put it on the snack table. <laughs>